starts after the Christmas holidays, 2011, and it's our, uh, really, it's my first investigation of the year that I've been able to go on. Um, it's public residence here in Fort Wayne, Indiana. The couple's been living here for a few years. Definitely a lot of EVPs, uh, just sounds when they're in the other room coming from an opposite room. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna get, we're gonna ready to lock this down, go dark, see what, you know, happens. So far, I've heard a voice in my ear. What'd you hear, Brian? I heard, like, a moan sound, like, <sighs> Yeah, we, uh, Andrea and I were actually in the other room, and he was sitting in the living room, and we both actually heard that at the same time, so, uh, hopefully we'll get a lot of good footage here. Um, like I said, it's the big first investigation in 2011, so uh, we'll show you some footage to see what we find. So how long have you lived in this house? It's not me, it's not going to... You. Um, I've, I've been living here for a little less than a year. And what kind of activity have you guys been experiencing? Um, mostly, we've been, without trying to investigate, um, we've caught footsteps, the sounds of doors opening or closing, and... But we never actually see it open or close, so we're not really sure if it was open or close to begin with. Um, voices, um, a lot of walking, pacing back and forth. How's, how does that make you guys feel? Um, personally, yeah. me, it makes me excited because I'm, I try to catch this stuff. Every time I do this, I almost every single time I do an investigation, even if it's only like 10 minutes long just for shits and gigs, I almost always catch something. And uh, so I'm personally not too worried about it. The only time it bothers me and kind of gives me the creeps is when I'm trying to sleep. Do you feel like anyone's watching you or like floating above you or? No. Oh. Did anybody? I do. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now see with that going off and it being close, that could have been why that went That's off. That's why that I went could off. Try it. I mean, does it doesn't do that really. Yeah. Yeah. Could you say something again? We just want. To uh, see, that's why the EMF detector went off. So all I was saying was that um, um, when he asked if you were like somebody was watching you, I do. That's um, the creepy part of this for me. It didn't go off. Say that. Again. Yeah, say no, something. It's it's on a three a three, you guys. It's on three. Did it say anything? It, it, it did. did. Oh, something. It's making it beep. This is not making a beat. Well, no, watch him sleep. Yeah. Going down. Was, did you guys just like, like move something? Like here. Yeah. Yeah, that was me. Whoa. Oops. Maybe not. <laughs> was that you? It's dead now. There's absolutely nothing. Is there any way down here? Yeah, could have been thinking that might be there. Hey, whoa. Can you do that again? Can you turn my light off on my camera again? That was weird. I have a button you actually have to push to do it. And it's never just accidentally done that? No, no. Turn off on a time limit? Nope. I didn't turn it back on either. You can turn it off, big guy. Come on. You know you can do it. Sorry, I'm just in both of them dad. go upstairs. Huh? Yeah. Okay. 
Are you here? Come on, show me that you're here. I know you're here. I know you can do it. They go upstairs. You see, that's almost like it's another one of those things, you know. What? If it if they turn it off, is it because it's loose and it's finally losing that energy from the tip of it to the battery? Right. Can you push? Go ahead. Can you push that flashlight down the stairs? Come on. There you go. Come on. All the way, big guy. Poor girl. Come on. All the way. Shut it Completely off. off. You can do it. Come on. Oh. Come on. Come on. No. Oh, come on. Can you push it off the stairs? Make it fall down? Please? Show me you're here, come on. Come on, you can do it. Almost, come on. Push it. Throw it down the stairs, come on. Come on, we know you can do it. Come on. I believe you're here. Come on. You're better than that. You wanna get us, you wanna? Come on. All the way off. Turn it back on. Thank you. Now turn it off. Don't let whatever that was scare you. Yeah, don't let the big guy upstairs scare you. You can do it. Turn that all the way off again. Well, as low as you can go. How low can you go? Come on. I got 12 minutes left too. Mine just actually, like, it just took 10 minutes yeah. of uh, battery life. I am a motivational uh, speaker for the paranormal now, so yeah. <laughs> you know we like to encourage them to. Uh, it's like the like Special Olympics, but uh, more of the flashlight Olympics for the paranormal. So. Come on, turn it off. My battery's almost dead, so give me some good footage. Come on. Come on, you can do it. You don't need to be camera shy, there's only one. You almost had it shut off. Come on. I believe you can do it. Josh believes you can do it. Let the whole world know you can do it. Come on, turn that flashlight off. All the way, just hit it. Throw it down the stairs. Come on, you can do it. Toss some shit up. You've, you've drained my battery long enough. Let's see it. Toss that bad boy down the stairs. What? What? Well, it's pissed and it feels really warm right by there. So as soon as you started yelling. Look. Wait, we're yelling at it? Yeah, you guys are yelling at it downstairs. This started going off. Oh my god. That's really warm up here. Yeah. Like I said, I was getting, I said, oh my god, really I'm feeling warm, warm like, right in my here. face. Oh, it is warm. Like, wow. as, soon as, he, as soon as somebody started yelling, this went was. off. It was just sitting right there. Oh. And it's, it went, it jumped down. It's still pretty fun. Yeah, Can but I mean, it was just at the, like, end. <laughs> we don't normally in residential houses have yeah. a like, you know, con like communication like this. Really? No. Because Sunset was pissed. This is unusual. <laughs> Isn't it, Josh?